dark mode. All of the contents of your desktop are automatically arranged into these stacks. Our next release of macOS is macOS Mojave. And I'd like to show you a new side of Mojave. We call it dark mode. All of the contents of your desktop are automatically arranged into these stacks. They can be arranged by kind, by date, or even by tag. And we call it desktop stacks. Some great new changes to the Finder. Now we've added an all new view called Gallery View. And of course, with images, sometimes you want to know more detail about, for instance, how they were captured. And now the new sidebar in Mojave really helps because it now supports full metadata. So for instance, if I have a photo like this and I want to edit it, I don't have to open it, go or do a new app, I can rotate it right here inside the Finder. Now in Mojave, we've made Quick Look more powerful than ever, ever by integrating markup. So you see down here, I have a permission slip in a PDF document. I'm just gonna hit tap spacebar to quick look it. And you notice now I have the option to invoke markup. I click and now I have access to my markup tools, including my ability to sign this document. We've made screenshots more powerful than ever. I'm gonna screenshot a selection of the page. And I want you to watch what happens in the lower right. I get a thumbnail instantly of that screenshot. And when I double click in, I get an accelerated workflow right into markup where I have access to all of my tools. But we've also added screen capture for video. I'd like to turn to apps. We are bringing news to the Mac. We also have stocks coming to the Mac. We're also bringing voice memos to the Mac. Finally, thrilled to announce Home is coming to the Mac as well. All of your accessories here, you can run your scenes, as well as monitor your video cameras. And of course, with Siri, you can command your home with your voice. I'd like to talk about security and privacy. Well, we've all seen these, these like buttons and share buttons, and these comment fields. Well, it turns out these can be used to track you, whether you click on them or not. And so this year, we are shutting that down. If you want to interact with one of these or one of these apps tries to access that information, you'll get this and you can decide to keep your information private. So we've redesigned an all new Mac App Store from the ground up. Microsoft will bring Office 365 to the Mac App Store later this year. And Adobe is bringing Lightroom CC. Days like this only come from years of effort, and hard work, and great sacrifice. Let's have an incredible week together. Thank you.